Jessica Thiesing. I am a economic developer with Salt Lake City, but I'm also a potter and have been for almost 20 years. Today at Ceramic Supply USA, we held a workshop for Craft Lake City, and it was a wind chime workshop. I am not fooled by the morning sun. So we rolled out the clay, we had each student punch out whatever it was they decided to make. So whether it be a, a strip or a swirly or a, an animal or a heart or whatever, they were able to do that. And then they were able to make beads and then smooth out the edges, punch the holes, and then now they're laying flat to dry. I really love working with clay, I really love teaching. And I came upon this studio and they weren't quite teaching classes yet, they were thinking about it. And a couple months later I got an email and it said, would you mind teaching a class? And I said, well, I will teach a class if you will allow me to have workshops for Craft Lake City. There comes a point in every night. My name is Audrey Jacquard, and I'm the studio manager at Ceramic Supply USA. Since we opened in December, it's a very new place to the area, and um, it's great anytime to partner up with uh, crafty type organizations so that more and more people can learn of what we have to offer. And uh, it is a medium that's not available uh, necessarily to bring home and try yourself, so it's great to open it up for the community to be able to come and do fun things. Anytime you're working with ceramics, you first work with the raw, wet material, the, the mud, the dirt. So we'll dry, we'll biscuit, and then we'll glaze it, and it will be a finished product. We're going to require that people come back and actually fire it, glaze it, and string it. My first kind of experience with Craft Lake City was the Craft Lake City event, where it was my first summer here, and I, I was looking for you know something different and fun and I happened to cross it and I, I fell in love and um, just think that everything that the organization does is, is just really awesome for our community. You're my